We are here today in Richmond Hill, Queens at the Girls and Boys Club on Atlantic Avenue, and we're here to give out these bikes. We raised some money between the International and District 15, our local 447 and the Independent Drivers Guild. The machinists have always been great around the holidays with coat drives and, and clothing drives and food drives, and, and we've done a lot of that at the Independent Drivers Guild as well. Uh, but right here, this event is, is really great. It's the first time the machinists are having a bike drive and they asked the Independent Drivers Guild to be involved and donate a, a portion of the bikes and we were thrilled to do it. John DeFazio, which is their uh, big sewer contract, is out on Staten Island. So he came up with a garage, gave me the garage there and allowed us to work in there for the month. We had the bikes delivered there. And then we had uh, members from uh, UPS and, other, uh, and some other shops that, that were glad to give us their time to assemble these bikes. And uh, took no time for these highly skilled mechanics and machinists to uh, put together. They actually had a good time with it. There's about 150 bikes, and then we assembled them. We, we may, had like a couple of marathon sessions, and we set it up pretty good. We had an assembly line and a quality control, and it was really good, it was, it was fun. Through associations we have with truck rental, they were uh, kind enough to give us a truck. Well, there was actually some children leaving here and some little boys were crying as they were leaving. And I was assuming because they wanted a bike and you know, it wasn't time to give them out yet. But also it was nice to see the people who work here were very overwhelmed by the fact of how many bikes we were bringing here. And they know what joy it's gonna to bring to the children that are gonna receive them bikes, you know? Well, we were just told that they're gonna be here with their parents for some type of event, but they don't know they're getting any bikes here today. So it should be nice to see the smiles on their faces and whatnot when they do get them. I think they're gonna be really excited. We've got bikes all different sizes and all different colors, and I think they're gonna come in and really be surprised as to, as to what they're getting today. You know, my kids are big, so it's a long time since I've seen them, you know, that spark, you know, when they get on the bike. But uh, I get, I'm sure we're gonna see a lot of it today. You know, just thankful that I was included in this. It's a great uh, community center for a lot of kids and really a lot of our members' kids. Many of them are low-wage workers and depend on community centers like this, like the Boys and Girls Club, so that they can get child care and, and, and know that their kids are safe while they're out working to try to provide for their families. We were more than happy to make our contribution to this great cause and we, we hope to bring a lot of smiles to a lot of kids. I would love to do it again. Uh, it's a huge undertaking, but you know, I guess we've got a year to worry about it. It's always great to give back to the community, something Labor's been doing for many, many years, and we wanted to keep up the tradition. But again, we're happy to be here. We want you to enjoy the bikes, be safe, and Merry Christmas.